The big story, scandal in the Detroit Police Department. A veteran officer on leave accused of beating a naked, mentally ill woman at Detroit Receiving Hospital. This video, Chief Craig says, is at the center of the investigation. It was obtained by Oso oh Radio and shared with us. It shows the officer punching the woman. Tonight, that officer is suspended with pay. The prosecutor's office has launched a criminal investigation, and Action News is learning new information about the woman at the center of it all. We have Team 7 coverage starting with 7 Action News reporter Simon Shaykat with that video and new information on the investigation. Simon. Dave Heather, the police chief is calling this disturbing and he says what happened here at Detroit Receiving Hospital warrants criminal investigation. A chaotic scene inside Detroit Receiving Hospital. Police Chief James Craig says the woman seen on video being punched had just spat at an officer and tried to bite police. However, in this video provided to us by Oso oh Radio, you can also see a police corporal throwing punch after punch. We immediately suspended the officer. He is suspended as of right now, and our investigation is continuing. Chief Craig says this witness video from Wednesday evening is now evidence that will help determine the outcome of a criminal investigation. We've learned the woman was not properly handcuffed, but simply restrained by other officers. Why? She showed no signs of aggression during transit. But once the force was used and the suspect was contained, uh, a supervisor was notified. Police say the corporal is an 18 year veteran with a good track record. Detectives are still looking into body camera video and talking with witnesses. So far, they're not releasing the corporal's name. In this instance, while the injury wasn't as significant, certainly uh, the gravity of uh, uh, this incident certainly warranted that we would have our force investigation team. Now, police reports, uh, body camera footage and other evidence are all very important in this case. We have made freedom of information requests for all of that as we move forward covering this story. Back to you.